Recently, Rocksteady did something really awesome. They stripped games for Windows Live out of Batman, Arkham City, and Arkham Asylum, and upgraded everyone who had the base versions of the games to the Game of the Year edition, which is like super, super stand-up on their part. Um, but then if you have old save files and you want to know how to migrate them over, you might have problems. And I'm hoping to help you f solve that. You'll notice that I have two um, Explorer windows open. I'll get into what these are. Essentially, one of them is from the Game of the Year edition, which I had to download and install, and then the base version, which is what I had before. So um, what you're going to want to do is migrate over to the Game of the Year edition, because the base version still has games for Windows Live in it. So if you don't have the new one installed, sorry. But once you do that, you can go in here and and get in. It, you need to run it at least one time. So when you come into Batman Arkham City, the Game of the Year edition, uh, if you're just downloading it for the very first time, um, or maybe even if you're switching out from games f or for Windows Live version of the Game of the Year edition, um, you're going to come in here and you're going to have all these empty bits. So what you need to do is make a, uh, a blank save, and you're going to look at this and be very sad because it's like, oh crap, where did all my stuff go? Well, not to fear, we can fix this. Once you have created this basic uh, empty save, you're good to go. So once you get back out after creating your blank save file, it's going to be going to have been created in your user data file. Now, if you did not have the old version of of Batman Arkham City, i.e. the the base game that came out at, at the very beginning, and you only had the Game of the Year edition, um, you don't need to worry about this next part. But if you have the Game of the Year edition, uh, the way the where you need to go is you need to go into your Steam directory, which is probably located either on whatever drive you have it installed on. Uh, if you don't know about that, it's most likely on your C drive in your program files directory. But you go in there and you go into your Steam directory, and uh, one of the last folders is going to be user data, and then you go into the directory that is for your user ID. This, um, I, I don't know if that's actually specifically my user ID, but the folder that you need to go into for the older base game for Batman is this one, 57400. And then go into remote and you'll have some save files here that are prefixed by your Windows Live ID. If you don't have that and you just have the Game of the Year edition, then it will be in the folder 200 uh, 2600. And one really easy way that you can find it is it, and this only works if you just installed it, is if you go into date modified, it's going to be one of the very last folders installed. If you had the game of the year edition installed from like forever ago, then then you got to just look for it. Anyway, so notice that this save file is just save zero SGD. And the first thing that we're going to do is just out of an overabundance of caution, we're going to copy and paste it right exactly where it is, just so we have a backup of it. And then you open up your hex editor. If you try to do this in Notepad, you're going to have a bad time. Uh, as a matter of fact, notice if you drag it into Notepad, you have gibberish, which is not, it's just not going to work. So, Go ahead and open this up in your hex editor. If you look around line 26, you're going to see 00000003. Delete everything before that. Just select it all, delete, and then save it. Once you do that, you simply uh, you, you can drag it straight over or you can rename it first, but just remove your Games for Windows Live ID from the from the other one, and just copy it over, and you're done. When you load it up in Batman, which I will do right now, uh, you'll see that it's going to be right there.
So coming into Batman. And there you go. Um, you know, here's here's all my stuff still. And, you know, you, it, you know, all your unlocks are still unlocked. All the stuff you haven't looked at, you still haven't looked at. And, and we can uh, move on.